RB. So we have someone asking, how do they get over their uh, ADD? How do you get over your ADD? You're the one that we're going to ask. All right. (laughs) Uh, First of all, I'm going to say this right now, and I am not a doctor, but I will say (laughs) that probably 99% of the people out there who think they have ADD or ADHD really don't. They don't have clinical ADD or ADHD. What they have allowed allowed to happen is they let social media erode their attention span, which is why you can log on to YouTube now and you see shorts at the top of your YouTube app instead of the long form, right? Because they realized YouTube, which is owned by Google, realized TikTok and Instagram did such a good job with reels and TikToks with these short form videos. YouTube realized no one's watching our long form video anymore. So fuck it, let's put our shorts higher up and start promoting the shorts so that we can be able to compete with TikTok and Instagram. Mm -hmm. Well, what is that doing? Every time you get a notification, that is literally taking away your attention to your phone and you're watching 10 second, 20 second, 30 second, 60 second short clips. And then you swipe, swipe, swipe. Each time you swipe, that's called variable response. Variable response means you swipe and you don't know whether you're gonna like the next video or not. Just like Variable response, the best definition of variable response is someone goes to Las Vegas, they sit at a at a um, slot machine, slot machine. Mm-hmm. they put their $100 in, and they bet five bucks, push the button or pull the, pull the handle, and they're waiting for the little things to turn. They're waiting, am I gonna win or not? No, I didn't. Push the button again, variable, another, each time it's a dopamine hit until I won or not, lost my 100 bucks, or hit the jackpot of $10,000. Same exact variable response conditioning takes away our attention because we went from being able to hold our attention for whatever, fucking an hour at a time, two hours at a time, three hours at a time, which was known as flow state, where you Mm -hmm. can actually work, work out, pay attention to a friend. Look, go anywhere and watch two friends at a Starbucks. They'll have like a conversation while they're in their phones and they're just, huh, huh, huh. It's like, bro, are you here at Starbucks with your phone or with me, right? right? And so attention span has gotten shorter, number one. And then because they've gotten so good, all these apps at getting you to, like Pavlov's dog, respond to their notifications because you are you guys are dumb and you leave your fucking notifications on and every time you get a notification and a ping and a ding, guess what happens next? Yeah. You go, oh, I better check what's going on. So now you have lost impulse control. So when we lose impulse control and when we get conditioned to watch short bursts of videos and then go into this variable response loop of quick dopamine hits, we now start feeling like we have ADD and ADHD. So how do you get over it? Craziness. You ready for this? Hey guys, quick interruption to the show. Let me tell you all about the Truly Wellness Shot. If you're like me and you care about your health, hydration, and building a strong immune system so you can stay active and you can get after it in life, then you want to try the Truly Wellness Shot. I used to take 11 different supplements in the morning, things like vitamin C, vitamin D, vitamin B12, echinacea, ginger, and a whole bunch more. Now it's all included in the Truly Wellness Shot. I want to send you a 30 day supply for 50% off. Just go to truly.com, use the code word better. Roast, my name to get 50% off. You also get free shipping. You get a 30 day unconditional money back guarantee and $1 of every order goes to Shriners Children's Hospital. And when you use the code word Bedros and do the subscribe and save, which is a truly tribe program, every month you'll get a fresh supply of truly wellness shots for an additional 20% off and free shipping and $1 of every monthly order will go to Shriners Children's Hospital. So go to truly.com, use code word Bedros and take advantage of this amazing offer. Now, back to the show turn off your notifications turn off all your social media notifications and structure a time of day that you will go online to check what's going on on your social media and then log off after 10 15 20 minutes give yourself a time be disciplined Mm -hmm. the opposite of add is to be structured and disciplined with your time and attention instead of you responding to notifications you go ah it's 10 a.m I give myself permission for going online for 20 minutes to screen suck and be a retard for about 20 minutes <laughs> and then go back to my work, right. right? Now you're expanding your ability to pay attention to things longer. You're developing impulse control. You're able to stay locked in and focused on the tasks at hand. And the reason this is important is because the average American is screen sucking on social media for three hours a day. As I said on a recent podcast, you give me an additional three hours a day, I'll create another like, multiple seven or eight figure business within a year. Yeah. And so that average of three hours a day that people are spending on social media is eroding their attention, 
taking away their impulse control and killing their ability to focus, which feels like you have ADD and ADHD. So start locking in longer to things with your attention, start turning off your notifications so that you don't erode your impulse control. And over time, as you delay gratification, you will be able to all of a sudden get over your self-diagnosed ADD.